with a small chance of pineapples. Yeah. Yeah. Might stack two off rip. <laughs> we'll see what I do here. Um, nineteen fifty-five. Uh, yeah. Uh, it's very key to patient on these arrows too when you're waiting for the exact level that we're ejecting off. Like there is a level here, like sixty-two. Um, but when it comes to these entries, I want like actual like precise entries, like at my levels, because it's a it's a huge difference when it, if it, if it were to if it were to flip back up, right? It's like there's a difference from here to here. It's like a nice 12, 15 pip advantage point. It, it makes a huge difference in the trade, especially when you're taking these type of entries, compared to like when you're taking closures of other ranges, breaks up, breakouts. It's funny because like a lot of people think, oh, we're changing our strategy. We're not. Remember, year one, we took buys above here, stars below here. Year, year two, we learned how to take range one fake outs, range two fake outs, right? Year three, we learned how to identify the fake outs or yeah, anticipate the fake outs. Year four, we're taking, we're, we're, we're literally just anticipating the fake out, really, right? So each year we just evolve from just buys above here and stars below here. We got better at it every time. But it's not really us like changing our strategy or anything like that. It's, pretty similar it's adapting right every year you gotta adapt the strategy is never like really finished um five can it close below 27 seconds 